Welcome to CAD Concepts. Today we will explore 10 important block tools. We will explore in this project design, okay? How we can use these block tools to streamline design process and this will let you faster productivity as compared to traditional method. So, without wasting time, let's begin. Number one, block output. If you see this typical plan we have, okay? I want to extract entire block as a separate drawing file. We have multiple blocks in this drawing, different different blocks. Double PW command. Now just select all in on time, okay? Now provide here output location folder. Let this here block output. As you see here, you are getting each and every block in your entire drawing separately. As you see here. So as much as block you have in your drawing and you want to extract that each block separately, you can simply extract something like this in separate drawing file as you see here, you are getting each and every block. Number two, block list. See, this complete design we have, okay. I want to collect each floor block separately, okay, in complete string, serial number, thumbnail and quantity okay complete table let this double b l command and just select all this is okay enter one time and click here as you see here you are getting your complete block in table thumbnail block name and quantity this is the easiest way to collect your complete block in table in just one time same here also select all enter one time and click here as you see here. So, you can collect entire block in table separately in just one time as you see here. Select all in one time and click here as you see here. This one also. Select all, enter and click here. This is the easiest way to collect your entire block in just one time. Number three, part block details. Sometimes we are required part detail, okay. We want to extract from the drawing. QG command and take two point rectangle. Your area of concern. This part I want to extract. Now you see here. We are getting this part as a block dynamically, as you see here. And this part you can stretch simply. And we will collect here also QG command and take two point rectangle. Which proportion you want to extract as a block file, as you see here. Part detail you can extract simply and just click here, as you see here. And let the setting you want to choose. For example, if you want, if you do not require hash border, let this untick, okay? And just let this one time, let this rectangle, this part, okay? And just place something like this, as you see here. So this way you can simply place your block separately in just one time. If you see here, you are not getting this part, any border. So this way you can collect your, you can Extract your part detail from the drawing, something like this, as you see here. Number four, block rename. If you see here, this multiple blocks we have, but we are not getting proper name, and you will collect it will not come proper name because getting different different names. Double B R command, okay, and just select your block, and you are getting something like this. Just rename from here. And if you let this partial R means wherever this block you have, it will change everywhere. Let this TV and let this here table. So why this is important? This is important because if you will collect these blocks, so you, you will not get proper name if you have not arranged properly. And sometime if you have created quick block and that is not proper name, you can rename your block name simply. Number five, change block base. If you see here, this block we have, I want to change its base, different different base proportion, double V I command and click here. This way you can switch your block base point. Same here also you are getting here. Select your block and change base point. This way you can change your block base point here also and let this here and here also. Select your block and let this here as you see and here also and let this here. So this way quickly you can shift your block base point. Number six, create quick block. 
this part, this object we have, we are not getting one block. How we create we block? Just to click only. No need to provide any name, scale, nothing. Just we want to create in one time. Okay. Let this double B N command and select your entire object. Enter one time. Now provide base point. As you see here, it got simply created. Same here also. Let this here. Double B N command. Select your object and give base points. As you see here. Same here also. Select your object and give base point. And select your object. Give base point. This way you can quickly create your block in just two clicks. Just by selecting object and providing base point. Number seven. Add to block. See this multiple block we have. And if you want to add existing block, for example, this three block I want to add in one. Double B A command. Select your original block, remaining block, and enter on time. It got joined in one block. So this way quickly you can join your existing block with any new block. For example, I want to combine this kitchen block. Okay. Double B A command. Select your original block which one you want to add. This one. Select this one and enter. Now you see. These two blocks perfectly got added as you see. And I want to add this one also. Let this select this one and this one enter on time. And click here as you see. You are getting your block that perfectly got joined. And if you have part, uh, if you have part detail, you can join this way simply. Number eight, create insert block. See what is insert block exactly. I will let you what is insert block. If you see this object we have, we want to create without any base point. Double B J M command. Select all. So this is your insert block, and it has two features. It cannot be exploded simply, and second, it have no base point. If you see here, there is no any base point. And I want to make this one also insert block, and this one also. So insert block you can create that cannot be exploded simply and with no base point, as you see here, here also. So this is the easiest way to create insert block, which is not easily exploitable and without base point, as you see. Number nine, explode insert block. As we know, we cannot explode normally. So how we will explode insert block? If you see here, this block we have, okay. And I want to explode this insert block. Select your block and let this double B X command. So by double B X command, you can simply explode your insert block same here also double b x command select your object select your object and just explode something like this so this way you can explode any insert block by double b x command number 10 block title see if you see this proper this proper title we are getting how to create this title simply let this bv command okay dialog box will open let this say block list and this thing like scale and layer name you can choose from here and you want a1 a2 a3 a0 you can choose from here let this layer and let this here insert this is okay and place your area of concern as you see this way properly you can place your title block for your sheet as you see here this is the easiest way with proper scale you can place your title block for your drawing something like this as you see here to proceed this method must install YQ Watch plugin in AutoCAD. After that, you can simply proceed this method. And you can download YQ Watch Ultimate Guide. This book will explain with facts and figures that will help you to memorize these critical commands in a simple way. I hope you got this video helpful. Must like, share, and subscribe. If you have anywhere any doubt, must leave your comments. As soon as possible, I will try to cover your query.